Got something in the mail and I'm excited. Walk with me. It's cracking with a family. It's your boy Aunt Diesel. What's happening? My wife got me a Blue Yeti microphone. I think she liked me. I might be using this in a lot of these conversational videos that we always have, me and you. But that's not what we're talking about today. What we gonna talk about is my Vetter holster that I got in the mail. Got it about two, three months ago, but hey, remember, I went through a slump where I didn't know why I was doing this. Plus, it was for a force equalizer. It was getting the Cerakote work done. So when I got it, it was still in the Cerakote shop. I had no use for it at the time, but now I got my Navy SEAL sidearm. So let's talk about this holster now. And it has been opened already. You know, like I said, I've had this for a little minute. Did open it, but we're gonna act as if I didn't already do that. So let's go ahead and open it up. So we got this beautiful Vetter Holsters bag that it comes in. That's the holster there. Nice, extra serious size Crown Royal bag. We didn't invent the Kydex holster. We just perfected it. I like that. I like that, Veta. That was pretty slick. See what you did there. We got a target. Looks like a half court basketball court. This means I'm gonna be shooting from half court, knocking him down wet and then we got keep calm and carry on vetter holsters i like that that's probably gonna go on either one of my ammo cans or my safe i don't really like stickers and stuff like that on my safe but i don't know i i, I don't know where it's gonna go but it's gonna go somewhere and we got the letter from vetter holsters Yeah. Sincerely, Mike Vetter, owner, Vetter Holsters, LLC. Okay. And this is, this is the pack listing. So it's the Comfort Tuck Combat Cut inside the waistband holster for the models Sig Sauer P226 and P227 without rail because mine doesn't have a rail it's made out of black leather kydex color is black hand orientation right hand coupon 32 icon salute ma'am i'm a sub and i utilized your discount code took six dollars off it was a 60 dollar holster 10% off using 32 icon. Subtotal $53.99 plus $7.34 shipping, totaling $61.33. And I'm not mad at it because I've already fondled it, I've already molested it, and I like it. And then there's a picture of that specific style holster, the combat cut holster. And that is a picture of a Glock, what I'm gonna say is a 26. I don't know all the Glock numbers and all that shit. I know Glock 19, Glock 17. Them's the only two, all the rest of them. Don't ask, don't tell. So yeah, now that we got all that out the way, let's go ahead and unravel this holster. Here we go. Better holster, nicely pressed into that black leather. Dual clips, the clips feel pretty, pretty sturdy. You can make adjustments. And then here's the Kydex holster itself. Then on the back is the cowhide. So it's not gonna chop my tactical muffin top up. Don't judge me. And then as you can see here, it has three extra holes so it all depends on how deep you want to conceal it inside the waistband 
and then you can make that adjustment from the clip on this side move it up for deeper concealment move it down for not as deep concealment i'm really feeling that i like the texture all good but yeah just take a gander at that though that look that looks beautiful i mean I know Kydex is like malleable and everything. It's malleable plastic, but just look at the detail in the actual Kydex portion. I mean, I know they have gun prints and everything, but that looks like he had my gun specifically and configured it directly to my gun. Now let's see how the SIG P226 fits in it. Okay, it's nice. Now it doesn't have any retention, it doesn't have any retention, but we're not gonna be like this with the gun. We're gonna be like this with the gun. And it looks good, I'm really feeling it. I like how this is high up to where the gun will not touch my tactical muffin top. It's nice and beveled on the side so there's no sharp edges. I'm really feeling this. $60, not a bad holster. Now, I know what you're saying. Diesel, why would you carry a P226? Those things are heavy. It's not that much heavier than that big ass plate of barbecue that you stopped at my house for and only bought paper damn plates like you did something. It was in my feelings, as you can see, that happens fairly often to your boy. I don't wear a lot of jeans. I don't wear a lot of, I don't wear cargo pants. You know, that always seemed fairly corny to your boy, but you know, do you? I don't wear any of those. I don't wear a lot of belts because I wear a lot of sweatpants. You know, I wear a lot of sweatpants. Always keep them clean, always keep them nice. So what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to put the holster on, tighten down the drawstring on my sweats and see how it feels. And then I'll make that determination if when I want to carry this awesome Navy SEAL sidearm, I'll make that determination whether or not I'm going to wear jeans or I could just continue wearing my sweats. So be right back. printing nope just looks like the other side of my tactical muffin top but how does it feel when I sit down it's it's kind of stiff right now I ain't gonna lie to you you know I ain't gonna fabricate for nobody it's kind of stiff while I'm sitting down right now but it's it's brand new it's this is literally the first time it's been on my hip so I'm imagining it's gonna take some break in time similar to the Kimber 1911. Right. So it's gonna take some time to break in. Um, it does feel pretty good. It is holding up nicely. It does exactly what it's supposed to do and conceals a massive hunk of steel like this. So I'm really feeling that. I might be, and I love my Safari Land 570. When I, when I get my next few firearms, if they don't fit in it. This is the first firearm, by the way, that doesn't fit in my Safari Land, so that was incredible. I might have to invest in me some more inside the waistband holsters because I like the fact that you can't see it. You can't see it. I'm walking through the store, grocery store, big six foot, 240 pound black dude. I won't make anybody nervous. I won't make put anybody on edge. So I'm really feeling that. So I might have to invest in me some more inside the waistband holsters. I really appreciate y'all watching. I really appreciate all y'all for kicking it with your boy, showing your boy love. Keep on leaving me comments. Keep on leaving me suggestions. It can only make me better. Y'all be easy. Really appreciate y'all watching. Stop playing with me. Don't study my moves, just check my footwork. Salute.